New tonight, a two year old Toledo boy is recovering from an apparent drug overdose. Police records say the boy's father where he remained in pediatric ICU tonight. Studio following this story. Tally, we're receiving word that this boy received significant amounts of Narcan. Yeah, three doses to be exact, Andrew. They were administered at the hospital after the boy's father rushed him there himself. To give you an idea, Toledo fire officials, who, who we will hear from in a moment, tell me an average 26-pound toddler uh, would be given a dose of 1.2 milligrams of Narcan, but they're only allowed to administer a maximum of two milligrams in total. That's not even close to a full second dose. So the three doses this boy received just shows how dangerous a situation this could have been. It's not a miracle drug. Not everybody comes back from an opioid uh, overdose. On Sunday, Narcan was in fact a miracle drug though bringing a Toledo toddler back to life. Police records say the boy was with his father at this home on Chase Street in North Toledo. The father, who has not been criminally charged, told police his son ingested methadone. That's when his father took off to Toledo Hospital just before 10 p.m. and the boy was given three doses of Narcan. In this case, it sounds like uh, it worked very well for the hospital staff and thankfully this uh, youngster is doing better. Private Sterling Ray with Toledo Fire and Rescue says this was one of the fortunate cases, while many others don't turn out so well. Ray stressed how much the immediacy of a situation like this is imperative, especially for young children. How much did they take? Um, what was the route of ingestion? How, what was the exposure? There, there's a lot of unknowns, so you don't know how quickly that's going to you know, affect the respiratory centers of the brain for that, that child. Tonight, police records say the boy is in stable condition as he recovers in the pediatric intensive care unit. But Ray says it serves as a reminder for parents to keep those drugs, both legal and otherwise, out of sight and out of reach. Nothing's ever foolproof, but if you can do everything, exhaust every measure to keep them away from, from your children or other children, that's, that's the key. Tonight, Toledo police detectives as well as Lucas County Children's Services are investigating. It is unclear if any charges will be pressed, but we'll of course keep you posted on our WTOL 11 app as we learn more.